Hey everyone, my name is Dr. Baron Grutter, and I'm going to make a series of videos using a software called uh, Tinkercad. Now, if you've seen any of my other videos, they usually resolve, revolve around um, dentistry and things like that, usually using some more advanced software. Now, I'm going to say that this series of videos is really designed for anyone to use, but in particular, I am setting up this set of videos to help my son, my eight-year-old son, learn how to do some design work himself and get into 3D printing. So this is really going to be uh, catered to a very, very wide audience and hopefully it's helpful to everyone out there. So first of all, I want to make sure that everyone that's watching this, um, if you are, you know, if you do still live with your parents, make sure you check with them, get permission before you start using this. I don't want anyone to get in any trouble, um, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started. And the first thing we need to do is we need to create a new account if you don't already have one. Now, Autodesk is a big company out there and they have lots of different softwares out there. One of the coolest things about the software Tinkercad that I'm going to show you how to use is that it's free and it runs entirely within your computer browser. So you don't need to install any special software. So if anyone's worried about having to download something or install something in that regard, then don't worry about it because it's not going to be a problem. Every uh, Just because it runs in the browser, um, most all computers can run it. Uh, you don't have to have a really expensive, fancy computer to get it going. And um, so that's also super appealing. So really all you need to do is you need to come to go to tinkercad.com. That's T-I-N-K-E-R-D-E-R-C-A-D.com and go up to uh, join now in the top right corner. Now, this is where you're going to need a little bit of help, potentially. You're going to need to create an account. Sign If you have um, some access to this at school, you might be able to link right here through here. But in this case, I'm going to go ahead and go to create personal account. And I'm going to create an account with an email address. And I'm going to go ahead and click here. And it's going to ask me to fill out some information. Okay. I'm going to uh, pause the video for just a minute and get through a couple of these steps because I'm going to create a new account right now. Okay, so I went ahead and I inserted my daughter's, uh, my six-year-old's uh, birth date and her name, made a password, and I had to put in a parent's uh, email address because of the age, because she is a minor. So in that case, it sent an email to my email address and it gives me a code so that I can approve it. So again, if you're a minor, you need to do that. Work with your parents and have them approve your account. So just a second, I'm going to go ahead and find that password on my own. Let me see if it's popped up in my email. Yes, it has. And here we go. Okay, so I have gone ahead on my phone and I have approved it. Now, one thing that is a little different here is that your parents are going to have to pay 50 cents to get you approved. And I do believe that is refunded um, or there's also a way they can just send in something and wait a few days for it to get approved. So just be aware that's again, that's one of the reasons we have to go through this process. And that's why the first video is just going to be getting the software set up and going for us. Okay. So I've already approved it. So I'm guessing that if I were to just refresh this page, it's probably going to, under, it's going to, um, allow me to start working away. And yes, it did. So now you can see that my daughter's name, Nella Grutter, her user account is up here and we've got various things that we can work on. But right now her account is kind of boring because we haven't done anything. But that's okay. The next couple of videos, we're going to get going on actually designing some things. Um, but for now, uh, we will go ahead and end this video. So project one that you have for you is you need to get set up with an account. Work with your parents, get that straightened away, and then the videos from hereafter should follow.